So you got me? Hey, how are you? Oh, you know. So I mentioned to you a while back about possibly doing a competition for shooting. Um, just because every time I'm around you guys, I feel like it's, it's the cool kids club. Uh, and I should try to look into it. What do you think? I absolutely think you need to do it. And we have the perfect match for you. It's a beginner's match. Um, it is a PRS style, but it's beginners. So all new people, the experts come in and they help everybody. So it's really inclusive, it's really helpful, and it's a great match to start. Okay, so I have no idea what you mean by PRS style. Is that a problem or are they gonna, am I gonna just like walk into nope. this thing blind or? Nope, they will teach you everything. So PRS is Precision Rifle Series mm -hmm. and it's a lot of stages that you're gonna go through, time stages, different positional shooting, target acquisition. Okay, so you know, right now, I mean, I've got a lot of guns, but I don't know if I have anything best for what we're getting into. Is that something I should look into, like a Ruger Precision type gun or any recommendations? Yeah, so I think the Ruger, that RPR in a 6.5 Greedmoor is such a great gun to start with, um, especially for this. It has enough legs that it's gonna get, get you out to the longest distance you're gonna see in most PRM matches easily but I have a great guy to introduce you to um, Jordan Glassman he's done he does all of the Mason Dixon PRS who is hosting this PRS beginners match um, he's also a police officer he has a lot of expertise in precision rifle series and and how to shoot it so he can give you a lot of good tips he can help you get set up and you guys can have a fun day on the range okay cool well, let me try to hunt down an RPR in 6.5, and that'll be the first stop there, and then I'll work on optics and stuff, and um, let's, get, let's get with Jordan and get moving. Perfect, I can't wait. You're gonna do amazing. I'm gonna try my best. <laughs> Hey, man. Jeremy. Jordan, nice Good to meet you. Buddy. Hey man, you too. Help me up setting this thing up. All right, what do you got? Well, we've got the Ruger Precision 6.5. Uh, we're gonna shoot some Hornady 143s out of it, but you know, beginner at this, right? Shoot, I've shot guns, I've hunted my entire life, but you know, never shot competition. Okay. Um, you know, if anything, I'm a plinker, right? Out in the, you know, on the power lines, shooting, just having fun. But I uh, figured, you know, why not with the competitions coming up and a big beginner opportunity. You know, I really wanted to get out and get behind a gun and see what it was all about. All right, we'll get you set up, get you, uh, get you shooting some stages, get the gun all squared away and get you on some steel. Cool, I guess first things first is we got zero this thing. I mean, straight out of the box, we just put the loop hold on it. Okay. Um, so we've not fired a shot out of this thing yet. Okay. So we'll fix that. I'll pull the bolt and fold the stock, uh -huh. and I'll actually try to bore sight it and match what I'm seeing through the bore with what you're seeing through the scope to at least get you in the general yeah. area. Yeah. So you just throw the That's bag underneath cool. the uh, grip or something like that, just so you have something stable. Yep. But try to at least get the same aiming point. That bag's gonna be huge. Let me give you a game changer. Okay. So I'm eyeballing down the bore itself. Yeah. So you're, if you're looking at number eight, you yep. can even use one of the number boards if it's yep. easier. Yeah. But something that stands out. So. And then just trying to dial. Yeah. So if you can see that brown square on the white board in your bore. Yep. Just come up to your scope without moving the gun, and see where your crosshair sits. You know, compared yep. to that. It'll put you, nine times out of 10, it'll at least put you on paper, so then we can we can get you zeroed without wasting a bunch of your ammo. Gotcha. Should be pretty close, right? All right, there. so just, just take a look through the board, just make sure you're still kind of in the same spot. Yep. All right, cool. Throw the bolt in, we'll take a couple shots, see where you land. All right. 
Yeah, that's cool. I never did that before. But you want to be as straight as possible so your shoulder will take the recoil. Okay. As best as you can, just spread your legs out and try to put your feet flat. Okay. There you go. You ready? Yep. So I want you to take your first shot at the center of that paper. Don't worry about any of the dots or squares. Okay. And then we'll see where it goes from there. So it looked like you were very high, which means you have to come down. The windage, so I saw a dirt kick up, the windage looked decent but uh, it looked like you were over the target. So I'm going. So you'd have to come down. Down. Yeah. So you're, so use the number, use the number eight as a guide. Yeah. Keep the gun still and then rotate the turret where your crosshair comes down to that brown piece of paper. Okay. Once you're somewhat in the center of that brown piece of paper, we'll take another shot. where that went same hole uh-huh like that so i would if it were me and that were my gun i wouldn't touch that you wouldn't touch it nope because you're you're well, just you're the one who instructed me on the class i don't know what the hell i got to hit at the end of the day <laughs> <laughs> if i've got to hit a paper plate i'm good yes no you're i would not mess with that you're maybe maybe a tenth off but honestly, with factory ammo yeah, and you know factory gun, I mean, you know it's. Uh, I wouldn't change a thing. Okay. Well. And as far know. as your windage turret goes, I never zero my windage turret. Some people do. Really. Because I'm never gonna dial for wind. Sure. Um. So I just throw the cap back on it. And let okay. it go. Did it? That's it. Did you want a high five? Yeah. Oh, I thought we were gonna jump. <laughs> that was like dumb and dumber. <laughs> total, total white guy high five.